1912, Richard McGrath, a fossil collector, discovered the remains of a unique species at the Egyptian site of Al Barahi. Three years later, in 1915, Ernst Stromer named the creature Spinosaurus aegypticus, meaning Egyptian spine lizard. But it took 21 years before he published information and produced his first reconstruction of Spinosaurus in 1936. It mostly resembled a Tyrannosaurus with large forelimbs and a large spine on the back of the creature. He briefly compared the elongated vertebrae spines of Spinosaurus to tall narrow spines seen on other dinosaurs, bison, some chameleons and other lizards. He eventually concluded that Spinosaurus had a tall, narrow, cell-like structure. In 1944, the only remains of the fossil was unfortunately destroyed in an Allied bombing raid. Stormer had made repeated requests to the museum that the fossil be moved to a safer place. They did not. With the Spinosaurus fossils destroyed, the intelligence had to rely decades on Stromer's drawings and descriptions of the lost beast.